What is up guys, it's your boy Salt Wolfie here. And today is surgery day. But um yeah, today I'm having surgery, it's I have a hernia. And um yeah, some of you guys knew about this, some of you guys didn't. Most of the people at my school knew about it. I don't really tell people on I guess social media and YouTube I guess. So yeah, that is today and I'll be back at like twelve. Probably like one o'clock I'll be back and done. I'm gonna bring you guys with me. I'm gonna sort of vlog this. I don't know how they turn out because I already feel awkward. We'll see what I do. But um, yeah. Hopefully everything goes well. Of course. I think I think I'll be fine though. I'm not really gonna be honest with you guys. I'm a little bit scared. I'm just a little bit because it is it. There, there always is that slight chance that you could die from surgery. But besides that, I think I'm good. Yeah, I kind of just woke up out of bed. You know. So yeah, I don't vlog. I don't know what vlog people do, but um, yeah. So the words kept repeating over and over and it was weird. <laughs> You're the one no, repeating. I wasn't to shut up. It's the weird feeling, yeah? They can't, they can't really put, when do they press out? <laughs> really don't worry about it. That's the way it is. Because I gave you the second gas and I was just looking at him for like 10 seconds. How did you know it's a 10 second? Because I was just counting. Oh, you're counting it? So maybe because of your counting, it just the way you pass it afterwards. Once you get it. You can't really remember because you pass out. Like it will be over. I the blanket warm. Yeah, you give your auntie that one too. The warm blanket. It's so hot. One of the nurses was kind of cute. <laughs> <laughs> I know you're a guy. <laughs> I couldn't see him or something because I don't have glasses or something. It sucks. <laughs> At least you recognize that they're cute. She's Asian? I don't know. My picture's white. Oh. Mm -hmm. It's not uh, Italian? You didn't see her no more when you get up? I didn't get I just I literally when they, I guess as soon as I got in this room, is when I woke up. Oh. Oh, you see, see her, no, no. Probably. <laughs> I hope I hit my dick and go hard. <laughs> You're crazy, no? I never heard from you that. Oh, your mama, are you okay? You never took that way of running away anyway, because you're fine. <laughs> you are not. I love you, though. What is the gas I want to do? I guess it would give me a really bad headache. What's that? The first gas. Like, I could remember everything, but I couldn't think. I kept hearing the sound, like I said. You know that? This is recording, you know that? All of them kept saying I was doing good. But I think they're just supposed to say that. Yeah, to encourage you, though. That's the way they do. Good. I still have an IV line. Huh? No more. You don't have none. You don't have none. Yeah, because it kept messing up. Yeah. 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 What is up, guys? We're in Chick fil A right now. I don't feel 
like shit. What is up guys, I'm back home, finally, and um, I still have the, I guess, medicine through my system, because I don't feel any pain yet, but um, yeah, so far I'm fine, they gave me some like, OP Tylenol to take if, uh, if it hurts really bad, and apparently you gotta take some like, uh, laxative basically, because the medicine is supposed to give me the, the, the shits basically, that's always nice. And by the way, I have no shirt on because it's fucking hot in my house. Sorry about my language, but, um, yeah. I guess I'll, some story time, I guess. Um, well, first, I'm just gonna talk about what this happened. Okay, well, obviously the lady took me back to the operating table. And I was kind of, it was scary walking in there. You walk in there, and it's literally all white, and literally, like, five doctors looked at me with their masks, and I was like, oh, shit. That was kind of scary. And, um, I took off my, uh... I guess, gown and stuff, of course, and, um, yeah, G gave me a nice warm blanket, that was, like, the best part, and then after that, they gave me this laughing gas, it was weak laughing gas, I was kind of scared, because, um, I thought that was the gas they didn't give me for the surgery, and I felt everything, because they didn't really, they, all they did was put an IV in my arm, and as you can see, I have two holes, he messed up, the, the darker one, he messed up, so he put another one, and that literally felt like, and he told me to squeeze his finger, so when I started squeezing his finger, felt like a knife was cutting through my skin. But the laughing gas wasn't, it was a weak one, it didn't do much, so I felt all the IV needles, or IV needle going in me, which is kind of painful. felt like a really bad pinch, and um, yeah. And after that, they told me to relax after they had the IV in, to put my, put my arms out to the side, and um... Yeah, they gave me the heavy laughing gas, and that shit was OP. Like, it t it sm tasted or smelled weird, I guess you would say. And, oh my god. I guess I was out in, like, two seconds, because I don't remember shit. I just remember... I just remember breathing it in, and he was, like, talking to me, and, I was, and then just started dope. Oh, yeah. By the way, when I had the weak laughing gas, I kept hearing weird sounds. I don't know if I was going crazy or what. But, um, basically, I would hear someone repeating the same words over and over again i don't know if it was like a doctor doing that on purpose or what it felt it was really weird but after the, okay after that heavy laughing gas i was just breathing that and then i don't even know how long for maybe five seconds and all i remember after i was waking up on the trolley and just in the room with an iv in my hand and drinking gatorade or powerade and just Talking about weird stuff. I don't know what I talked about. I don't remember anything. I just I remember I was very, very dizzy afterwards. It wasn't even painful at all. I'm just very dizzy. That was about it. So, yeah, that was fun. I'm going to rewatch that. You guys are probably going to enjoy watching that. I talked about some weird stuff, I think. I really don't remember. But, um, yeah, I think that was, I think that was it. I got to sit in a wheelchair and get pushed around. That was kind of cool, I guess. Um, I just hope the doctors didn't joke about my dick, you know, because that would be weird. <laughs> um, I think that's pretty much it. So I guess I'll see you guys later, or maybe tomorrow I might get back, I might come back on and tell you guys how painful it is once the pain kicks in. But we'll see again, sorry about my, I don't have my shirt on, it's just very hot. I might just, I'm just going to watch Netflix and chill by myself because I have no friends. Just kidding, I sort of do. And, um, yeah, my lips are very dry. Uh, I couldn't, I, I haven't ate since 5 p.m. That yesterday. I just ate after surgery, though, and drank stuff, because I didn't drink anything after 1 a.m., so I was very dehydrated. 
Yeah, overall, the like, surgery went very well. So, I'm not gonna lie, I was very, I was not very scared. I was pretty scared because all the horror stories and stuff you hear, it's just kind of messes with your head. Main reason I was scared is that I thought I would go into a coma. I don't know why. That was my worst fear. I thought I wouldn't wake up from it. But look what I did. By the way, the uh, surgery took like an hour. And for literally for me, I don't... It's so weird how I don't feel like there's a time difference. But there was. I feel a little tingling on my incision. So I'll, I'll try to show you guys this. I don't want to show you guys my, my dick. But I'll show you what the cut is that if you guys don't mind. It's right there. Yeah, it's swollen by the, it's swole by the way, swollen, swole, swollen, not swole. <laughs> it's swollen a little bit. So yeah, I'm blogging on my GoPro. I'm gonna be guy. I'm gonna be buying a real camera soon after my airsoft and PC upgrade. I'm thinking I'm gonna buy a new PC. I might uh, maybe have a little something, something. Give it to a friend maybe because I have a lot of friends who wants a PC. I might charge them like half the price of what it costs to build it. Or something, but um, okay, I'll shut up, guys. Let you guys carry on your day. I'll have a little short thingy for every day. So, I think day one starts after surgery, day zero was before surgery. So, right now it's day one, day two is when it hits, I guess, to 12 a.m. I guess. See you guys later. Bye.